Good morning, guys. It's Disney Cruise Day. Let's get going. Sherry is waking up. How excited are you to go on a cruise today? I'm very excited. I'm just waking. Do you not love having a camera in your face when you wake up? Not really. A little bit, though. Kind of. So we just ordered a quick room service breakfast. We have something to eat this morning before we go to the boat. We ordered a couple bagels with cream cheese and this fresh fruit plate. Look at how good that fruit looks. Uh, that is something about living in Alaska, especially during the winter. It is hard to find good fruit, so I'm excited about this. Uh, also, I have a question. This orange melon, what do you call it? I call it a cantaloupe. Sherry calls it a musk melon. I had never heard the term musk melon until we got married. Whatever you call it, it's delicious. We have checked out of our hotel, bags are loaded in the car, we have the short drive to the cruise terminal, and off we go. I woke up this morning probably more excited than even Christmas. <laughs> I cannot wait for like, this hey, cruise. He was like, hey, what is today? What is today? What is today, Sherry? Like, what is today? I'm still sleeping. Yeah, I'm a morning person, especially when there's something that's like exciting. Like if I have something to look forward to that day, like I'm just ready to get going. You take some time to like get going. I'm and excited for today, but I also don't just like wake up. You don't wake up and you're just like, let's go. I do that. Sorry. <laughs> there's the Disney Wonder. So awesome. We just dropped off our bags. Our car is parked. I've got my cruise ears on. Let's go to the terminal. So we parked in the parking garage. Now we're walking across the sky bridge. This is the Disney Cruise Line terminal here in Port Canaveral. And you'll see right over there, the Disney Wonder. We did comment that from the outside, uh, it is definitely smaller than the Disney Dream, which is the boat we cruised on last time, which is the biggest of the Disney boats. But still, it looks amazing. We just went through the scan. Here is the terminal. Good morning. So here in the middle of the terminal, they have a replica of one of the Disney ships. I think this actually is the Magic. Not life-size. And what would a Disney experience be without characters? You'll see Goofy is right here taking photos with people. We're killing time until we get on the boat, playing some war with, obviously, Disney cards. Sherry, who won the first game of war? I did not cheat, and I won. You shuffled, you dealt, and you won. And I feel like there's a correlation. I just won. <laughs> and now Pluto is the character here. We are about to board. They're doing boarding group number five right now. We are boarding group number six, so it's just about our turn. Here we go. We're about to go through the big Mickey ears to board the ship. So we are now crossing across onto the boat. Leg. We are on board. So here's Tiana's place. This is the newest restaurant they added to the Wonder during its last refurbishment. And we're actually super excited because this is the restaurant we're eating at tonight. And it is by far the one we are most excited to eat at. Sherry, how awesome is this? It's amazing. Like, just look at the detail. Let's, uh, even though we're gonna see it tonight at dinner, let's go look at it. This is awesome. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh my gosh. Uh, we'll obviously vlog more at dinner tonight, but you can see in here, Stage up front, so awesome. So Sherry, we're on board. Are you excited? <laughs> oh my gosh. So we're on deck nine outside. Here is like the kids splash play area. Little kid pool out there. You'll see the twist and spout water slide right here. And here, we're walking out. This is the main pool deck. Here's hot tub here. There's another hot tub over here. The pool is closed because we just got on the boat. It'll be open soon. You can see the giant funnel vision screen and the weather is amazing. Back here we have a bar, pizza, and now we're heading to the place we'll spend most of our time, the adults only area. 
So we are upstairs in the Cove Cafe. Cove Cafe now, after the Disney Wonders refurbishment, is two floors. Downstairs is the coffee shop, and upstairs is this great indoor sitting area. And now, our favorite part of the entire boat, the adults only pool section. This is the Quiet Cove pool. There's signals, the adults only bar. Only 18 and over, two hot tubs. And as you can see, almost nobody here because cruising on Disney as couples without kids is perfect. So we just finished lunch, kind of walking around the boat a little bit. You can see right now we are on deck number four, right below the lifeboats. Let's, uh, let's hope we do not ever need to use these. If we do, I'd let you go on the lifeboat before I did though. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. You're welcome. So now we are walking back into after hours, which is the adults only nightclub area. The nightclubs they have here are the Crown and Finn Pub, Cadillac Lounge, and Azure. I believe that Crown and Finn Pub is brand new since refurbishment. Azure is new. I think Cadillac Lounge might still be the same, but I'm not sure. And as always, here is Sherry taking photos of everything on the boat. This is Azure. Look at how nice it is in here. Again, Disney does everything top notch. Oh look, Sherry's taking another photo. Of what? Hey. A light. Uh, it's a dope light. It is a dope light. This is the Cadillac Lounge. Great looking kind of throwback bar. One of the things I love though, look their tables are old tires, hubcaps with glass on top. Place looks awesome. And of course, the back of the bar is like the front grill of an old car. That looks great. And this is the bar I've been wanting to see the most Crown and Finn, a proper English pub. You walk in, of course, the telephone booth. That's fun. I love Irish pubs, or English pubs, if you will. And this place looks amazing. Lots of dark woods, dark leathers. Oh, these game tables look great too. You guys, I just, I know that I'm a nerd, but I cannot get enough of these light fixtures. Look at how amazing they are. Hello, how are you? Good. So one of the things I love about the Disney cruise ships is at the top of every staircase, they have artwork. And this is from Focus. Story sketches from Walt Disney's film Sea Scouts in 1939. We've got Donald Duck, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Super cute. So it's 1.30, rooms just opened, and we are walking to our stateroom. 7067, this is us. Here is our room. So, time for a quick room tour. We did do an inside stateroom this time, uh, actually for a reason. Last Disney Cruise, we had a veranda stateroom on the Disney Dream, which is like one of the nicer rooms on the biggest ship. So, we got one of the inside rooms, one of the smallest rooms on the oldest ship, because we figured that now that we've had kind of both ends, um, if we like both of them, we know that we can cruise on any ship in any room and be totally happy. So when you first walk in, you have the bathroom here on the right. You'll see this does not have the split bath like a lot of the Disney rooms. There's the sink with the H2O bath products, toilet, and here's the shower. Again, most Disney cruise ships have the split bath, so there's a toilet and sink and then a shower. Here are our closet, just, you know, typical closet there. There is the safe here, more closet space. When you come in, you have the desk. You'll see we have our frozen meet and greet and our princess gathering tickets there. There's a TV. There is a mini fridge. Here is the couch, little seating area. Queen size bed. And since we've cruised with Disney before, 
we got this uh, pretty awesome Disney Cruise Line Castaway Club bag that they left us here as a thank you gift. So, I'm not gonna lie, this actually is pretty great. Sherry, what do you think? Super awesome. It is awesome. Um, again, my hope is that if this is great, if we like the inside room, then we know any Disney cruise ship, any type of room, and we will be happy. Yep. So excited. And of course, one of our favorite things on the Disney ships is the pillow on the bed that says, a dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. This is kind of fun. The art in the room are character sketches from Pirates of the Caribbean by uh, Mark Davis. That's pretty awesome. And of course, no detail is unthought of. You see the Mickey hands marking the elevator floor. We just came in this really cool mural hallway. This is probably, I don't know, three stories tall. Awesome scene from Little Mermaid, Flounder, Ariel. Pretty awesome. Can eat soft serve ice cream? Yep, that's gonna happen a lot. You can see up here on the deck is the basketball court here on the Disney Wonder. And here, foosball, ping pong, both of which I might have to beat Sherry at before we leave. This one thing is kind of awesome. You can actually see out there in the distance, that's the Cape Canaveral launch area for NASA. That is where uh, the shuttles are launched. Hey Sherry, in the event that we hit an iceberg and our cruise ship goes down, and they discover this camera 100 years from now, what would you like to say to the people watching? Nothing? You have no messages for future civilizations? You can't spring this kind of stuff on me. No messages? No messages. 7,000 years from now, they find this camera. It's at the probably bottom. eaten by fish by then. Nope, cannons are built well. <laughs> they find cannons at the bottom of the ocean all the time. From old shipwrecks. Get it? Cannons, like, but this is a camera and I was talking about actual can't like metal and we just started moving you can see the boat pushing off from the dock there you can see some of the Disney Cruise crew and staff coming out to wave the ship off it's pretty fun you watching us pull away Sherry Beth yes <laughs> Right in my face. Yes, it is. <laughs> and you'll see right there is the exploration tower that we went through yesterday. You see people at the restaurant waving goodbye to the ship. Here at Port Canaveral, lots of people come down to the water to watch the big ships leave. You can see some of them over there. <laughs> Well, we realized we're about a half an hour early for the show, so we're going to uh, sit here on deck four, enjoy the sunshine until the show starts. So since tomorrow is a sea day, this is the closest we'll be to land for a couple days. Adam, can you tell us what you learned on the last cruise? I learned how to call whales. Yeah, you want to do that? So we're in the Walt Disney Theater here on the Disney Wonder. You'll see pretty awesome looking theater. This is where all the shows are, the main like Broadway shows. There's Sherry, you were very close. Uh, the show we're seeing tonight is the Golden Mickeys. We actually saw a version of the show on the Disney Dream, but we believe that this is a different version. So we are super excited. Now we're in the elevator that's next to that aerial mural, and see, we're seeing it as we uh, go down. And there is the main lobby. And over there is Minnie Mouse. 
because it's Disney. So even though we were in here earlier, we are officially here for dinner at Tiana's place. By far, the restaurant we are most looking forward to on this trip. Well, with the exception of Paulo, because we know how amazing that is. We are going to our table now. So we just sat down. Disney pro tip. Obviously while cruising they try to seat you with other people, but if you call ahead and say you would like to sit by yourself, this is the second time, second cruise in a row, we've gotten our own seat by ourselves, table for two. We just get to be together. Perfect. And here's our table from Tiana's. You'll see the stage up there. There's Sherry checking out the menu. How does it look? Here's the cover of the Tiana's Place restaurant menu, and uh, let's see what they got. So here is the menu, appetizers, soups and salads, vegetarian entrees, the other entrees, the main entrees, uh, bread service, which we'll start with, lighter note offerings, and then we will get desserts at the end. On Disney, everything is included. So they start you off with bread right here, looks amazing, and this is their house roasted onion dipping sauce. We're gonna give that a try. So Sherry's uh, making up her bread and roasted onion dip. Sherry, give us the initial review. It's good? Awesome. Appetizers are here. Sherry got the sausage fritters. I got the shrimp and grits. Now question number one, are you hungry? Yeah. Yeah. So here's our soup and salad course. Sherry went with the wedge salad, looks great. I went with the seafood pepper pot. Oh my goodness. <laughs> So this is one of the really cool things about Tiana's place is Tiana actually comes around, talks to every table, you get photos with her. So in just a few minutes, Tiana is gonna come by our table. Are you excited to meet Tiana? The main entree is here. I got the Cajun sea bass. There's a nice big piece of sea bass under there, some shrimp an aioli sauce right there. So for Sherry's main entree, she got the prime rib of beef with uh, broccoli and look at that like twice baked potato. I might steal your dinner, Sherry. All right, Sherry, so far, uh, Tiana's, how is it? It is so good. <laughs> Who just walked by? Lewis, that's pretty awesome. So they just brought our dessert menu and it lights up with fireflies. Are you kidding me? Oh, here are the desserts. We've heard the buttermilk beignets are absolutely delicious. Although a banana's foster sundae, white chocolate bread pudding, canned nut tart, lemon raspberry mousse. Can I get all of those? Uh, also bonus to Chiana's place, I got Mardi Gras beads. Is everybody enjoying dinner? So for, we just got our desserts and we are gonna split a couple things. We have the buttermilk beignets with chocolate sauce. Oh my gosh. And this is a bread pudding with white chocolate and a scoop of vanilla ice cream. Yes, please. So we just came back to our room for the night, our little towel animal. What do you think that is, a swan? swan or a boy. cobra? <laughs> There's our personal navigator for tomorrow and our Ghirardelli chocolates. I'll take all three of those, so that'll be fun. If you need us, we'll be out here watching Guardians of the Galaxy on the pool deck because this is perfect. So it's almost 11 p.m. I think we're gonna end the vlog for today now. Sherry, day one from the Disney Wonder. Thumbs up? Yes. What's your highlight so far of today? Uh, dinner was amazing. Tiana's place was so much fun. So fun, so um, delicious. Like everything on the menu was great and the atmosphere was great and we and got to meet Tiana. And it's nice just being able to turn your phone off. Like we just left our room and I just left my phone in there and I don't even need it, which is, Amazing. So day one vlog is now done. 
we will see you guys tomorrow, which is at sea day. Um, so we're just gonna enjoy the boat and do who knows what. Actually, tomorrow we, have we, a lot planned for us. we are doing a princess meet and greet. Clearly, I'm the kind of guy for a princess meet and greet because <laughs> you're my princess. Oh, uh, we are doing a frozen meet and greet. We have a mixology class, so it's gonna be a pretty awesome day. Yep. See you guys then. Well, maybe our night wasn't totally done because we did just order a Mickey shaped ice cream bar, milk, and warm chocolate chip cookies while we watch Valentine's Day in bed. So that's how day one is going to end.